Okay, hey, collector. So this is going to be a collective reading. Okay, Spirit, what messages do you have here? So we have my precious here. We have soul contract. We have I am strong enough to heal. So I'm getting like you are closing out some type of contract here. That's what I'm getting here. Something could have had you up in your head in the past. That's what I'm getting. But you're moving forward. What's going on here? Give me just a second. So we had official person and we had angry fall on the floor. Somebody is upset because you are divine. I'm hearing divine feminine. Yep. Somebody is upset because they closed out some type of contract or they sabotaged something here. That's what I'm getting here. I'm getting like you were dealing with a lot of drama and chaos going on behind the scenes here as well. That's what I'm getting here. What's going on here with this situation, spirit? Yep. Yeah, I'm telling you, somebody knows that they messed up. That's what I'm getting here. You're healing and moving forward. For some, you could be dealing with a sibling here. What's going on here with this situation? Wow. We have distorted feminine. Somebody tried to end some for you or somebody wanted you in some distorted energy. Like somebody is upset because you are a divine feminine. You have a sibling that's literally mad because you are a divine feminine. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody is angry that you are successful or you are manifesting here. Something in regards to a side hustle that you have. Like you have a sibling that's mad about this. That's what I'm getting here. What's going on here? Look, to me, you are perfect. So this could be somebody that's in competition and you aren't even aware. I'm getting like you're just focusing on yourself or focusing on work. That's what I'm getting here. Like somebody is obsessing over something that you're doing. Somebody has a karmic contract with a sibling. Somebody's sibling is very karmic. That's what I'm getting here. What's going on here? Look here. Now somebody sees the truth or somebody sees that you are divine feminine. That's what I'm getting here. What's going on here? This person could have lied on you here. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody could have accused you of being a liar here. Give me just a second. Okay, so we had ADHD fall on the floor. Somebody could have ADHD here. Yeah, we have underestimated. We have painter. Somebody underestimated you. That's what I'm getting here. Yep, what's going on here? I'm also getting that somebody could be an artist. Something in regards to art. I'm getting your ADHD could be connected to your art or something like that. Or you're incorporating something in, into your art here. What's going on here? Yep. So somebody is closing out a karmic contract with a karmic sibling. Somebody that took you for granted underestimated you. That's what I'm getting here. Yep. The more we value things, the less we value ourselves. This person, Wow. I'm hearing somebody looked at you as less than human. Somebody looked at you as a thing. Wow. This is somebody that was in competition. What's going on? Somebody's sibling is resentful. Somebody tried to shut you up or somebody wanted you to stop talking here. Yeah, we have 20s. Wow. This person, somebody wanted to shut you up. Pause before speaking and we have finding the truth. Somebody wanted to shut you up or stop something for you. Something in regards to a side hustle. Or somebody didn't want you to say something here. Yeah, somebody is very karmic. What's going on here, spirit? Yeah, so you cut this person off or you moved away from this person. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody is sending you the evil eye because you are receiving some type of divine inheritance that you have coming in for you. Financial blessings. That's what I'm getting here. You're moving away from this person. Somebody didn't look here. This person also possibly looked at you as a thing because of some type of inheritance. That's what I'm getting here. Like somebody looked at you as a financial opportunity. They didn't even look at you as family. That's what I'm getting here. 
this person is now sending you the evil eye that's what i'm getting you have a divine inheritance coming in for you somebody is spiteful here what's going on here somebody is upset because you moved on or you're moving forward or just you're successful here yeah you don't want to deal with this person you're a good spirit somebody was sending you the evil eye somebody is upset because you are receiving some type of blessing i'm also getting that you could have been very reserved in the past or very like shy i'm also getting that you could have been afraid of having an opinion or something like that or somebody wanted to shut you up like somebody wants you to sit in the corner and shut up that's what i'm, I'm literally getting at this person could have been abusive for some you are dealing with a sibling here this i'm getting like somebody is an earth angel somebody treated an earth angel like shit that's what i'm getting here what's going on here yep now this person wants to contact you so somebody wants to contact you somebody wants your forgiveness that's what i'm getting here somebody could be in their 60s here as well yeah we have 12 12 here we have 33 here i'm getting like you are protected by spirit but somebody is watching you receive some type of spiritual inheritance because you stop being afraid of yourself that's what i'm getting here you took your power back I'm getting like now you speak your truth or you have opinions like you don't hold back. That's what I'm getting here. Definitely with this pause before speaking. Like somebody didn't want you to feel like you had a voice. Somebody did not look at you as a human. Somebody looked at you as a thing. That's what I'm getting here. Like somebody did not respect you as an individual here. Give me just a second. Okay, sorry about that. Like I said, this person could be one to contact you here. Yep. We have flow stay here. I'm getting like you are focused and moving forward or you are standing in your power or you cannot be moved. Somebody is not getting, I'm hearing like you are in your empress energy. Somebody is pissed because you are divine feminine here. That's what I'm getting here. Yep. I'm also hearing high priestess. Yeah, you're standing up for yourself. That's what I'm getting here. Wow, we have conspiracy facts here. What's going on here? I'm hearing you know what you know, period. Yeah, when you chase something that runs from you, law of attraction 101. Now somebody wants to have some type of connection with you after they abandoned you here, treated you like dirt. I'm getting like somebody treated another person like dirt. What's going on here, spirit? Yeah, we have feel that shit. We have new love connection. You're moving away from this person or somebody is having a tower moment here. Yeah, we have intel here. Somebody knows that you are connected to spirit here as well. Somebody knows that you are a light worker here. Somebody knows that you are spiritually gifted. That's what I'm getting here. The gift of sight. You are very blessed. You are very intuitive. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody is pissed. Somebody, wow, look here. With this conspiracy fact here, and stand, I'm getting like somebody did not believe in intuition or somebody did not believe that you were intuitive. I'm also getting like somebody did not believe that you were clairvoyant here as well. That's what I'm getting here. Psychic, yep. Somebody is upset. I'm Look here, I'm about to end this reading. I came in here with a purpose. I ain't round for clout. This is somebody that took you for granted. You have always been this empress. You have always been an earth angel. I just got chills. Somebody did not see this. Somebody did not see you in this light here. But I'm getting like, you don't care. You're standing in your power here. Somebody took you for granted. That's what I'm getting here. You're getting new blessings, new opportunities here. Yep, you're moving forward, away from the past. Yep, you're happy. Somebody feels bad for how they did you here. That's what I'm getting here, yeah. What's going on here? Wow, yep. You're spiritual. I'm hearing you're talented here. Whoever I'm speaking to, yep. I'm telling you. Somebody did not believe this. 
Somebody is shook in regards to something you did or said as well. That's what I'm getting here. Yeah. Somebody could have been trolling you for being spiritually gifted here. That's what I'm getting here or calling you crazy as well. What's going on here? Somebody treated you like shit. Yeah, earth angel. I'm hearing an earth angel. Let me grab that card. You cannot make this up. Didn't I just say somebody was dismissive in regards to you? Yep. We have fixed signs here. You could be one of these fixed signs as well. You can have these placements in your chart. Aquarius, Taurus, Leo, and Scorpio. Yep. Somebody was trolling you. Somebody is watching you move forward. I'm getting you are getting the last laugh here. I'm getting you're moving forward. You're not even entertaining some here. Yep. What's going on here? Somebody took you for granted. What's going on here? Yep. Somebody wants to communicate with you, but I'm getting like you have moved on. You have moved on. Somebody did not believe that you were intuitive or spiritually gifted or somebody did not believe. Wow, I'm hearing in psychics. So for some, this is a sibling or you could have somebody watching you with a sibling here. That's what I'm getting here. You know, a pot of roses they fit. Look, we have work colleagues here. I'm also getting somebody could work in law enforcement here. Yep, look here. I see both sides like Chanel. Didn't I just say the temperance card, Sagittarius energy? You're very balanced. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody is an earth angel. Somebody is watching you move forward. Somebody was dismissive in regards to you here as well. Or somebody wanted to shut you up here. I'm getting like you have moved on from this. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody wanted to shut you up or shut you down here. Yep. Look. I'm done. Anyone who tried to interfere with the destiny of another thing will never discover his own. I'm hearing like with this law enforcement, I'm getting like, wow, somebody is envious. Somebody wanted to end something for you. For some, you are dealing with a sibling here. But I'm getting like somebody was trying to monitor something that you're doing. Or somebody wanted you to stop doing something here. That's what I'm getting here. Like I said, for some, this is family. That wanted you to shut up or stop doing something here. Somebody wanted you sitting in a corner quiet. Wow, look here. I'm hearing only speak when you're spoken to. Somebody could have grew up in an abusive household. Somebody did not want you to have an opinion, have a voice. Somebody is terrified that you are speaking up or you are taking your power back here. Yep. What's going on here? Yep, you're moving forward. What's going on here? Or somebody was just like, a, with this law enforcement, somebody just could have been like a dictator here. This could have been a masculine energy that you were dealing with here. Or a father figure. I could be speaking to a masculine energy here. You know, a pot of roses, they fit. Yeah, you're very intuitive. Somebody wanted you to stop being intuitive. Somebody did not want you to you look here. There was something happening behind the scenes here. Somebody did not want you to use your uh, spiritual gifts and abilities to help the collective here. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody was trying to end something for you or something in regards to your spiritual gifts. Like somebody was trying to do something to you here behind the scenes here. That's what I'm getting here. Look, you are the black sheep of the family. Somebody tried to outcast you. Somebody did not want you to feel like you were divine. I'm getting you could be very quiet, very reserved, very shy here. That's what I'm getting here. Yep. Somebody outcasted you. What's going on here? Yeah, you are safe. You are protected here. Continue to move forward. You were a karmic lesson for this person to see how they would treat you, how they would handle you, what they would do when you came in. Somebody straight up outcasted you. Somebody had a choice. Somebody had a choice. 
in regards to how they would treat you. You were somebody's test. And somebody outcasted you or somebody left you out in the cold. Somebody treated you bad. I'm hearing somebody treated another person really bad here. Yep. You're connected with spirit here. Yep. Look here. Somebody definitely tried to isolate you. Somebody could be wanting to make a move towards you. Or somebody could be trying to contact you here. Somebody did not see your light. Somebody did not see you as divine. That's what I'm getting here. So this person outcasted you or moved away from you. This person could have trolled you here. This person could have tried to shut something down for you here as well. But you are protected and you're moving forward here. Anything else here? Yep. Oh, we. You could have been struggling in the past. I'm getting like you could have used alcohol to cope here. I'm getting like something was very traumatic that you went through behind the scenes here. That's what I'm getting here. In regards to a masculine energy, I could be speaking to a divine feminine here. Somebody did not think that you were a divine feminine or somebody did not think that you were their divine feminine. That's what I'm getting here. A masculine energy. A sibling is involved in a situation. A sibling could have worked to betray you here behind the scenes as well. Or a sibling is watching you. Or you could have a lot of people that are ganging up on you here. That's what I'm getting here. Yep. Look. I'm done. Be a good person, but don't waste your time proving it. Somebody, you, you could have felt like you had to prove yourself here. Definitely with this unrequited love here. Yeah. You felt like you had to prove yourself. You don't have to prove yourself. Move forward. You have new opportunities coming in for you. Somebody missed out on an opportunity with you here. Somebody did not feel like you were divine because you were different or you were weird here. Or you were not their idea of what their divine feminine would look like. That's what I'm getting here. And you struggle with this in silence. That's what I'm getting here. Yep. Somebody was very immature. Somebody also tried to sacrifice their divine feminine here. That's what I'm getting here. For some, and this is not going to be for everyone, but there is a masculine energy that went towards a divine feminine sibling that's what i'm getting here i'm getting like this sibling does not like this divine feminine this could be a sibling or this could be a friend but this individual does not like this divine feminine somebody messed with a masculine energy out of sheer resentment i've been picking that energy up here somebody was using alcohol to cope here i'm also getting something in regards to a codependent somebody look something almost broke another person this person healed that's what I'm getting here. Somebody is taking their power back and moving forward. Whoever the sibling is, or this could be, like I said, a fake friend or something like that. But this person never liked this divine feminine. So this person slept with a masculine energy. I'm getting like this uh, karmic sibling and this masculine did not feel like this divine feminine was a divine feminine because this person is different. Something in regards to appearance or somebody being really reserved, really quiet. Somebody being very curious here as well. Somebody felt like another person was quirky or strange or weird. Some type of unrequited love. Somebody left another person out in the cold here. But this person is taking their power back. Or now this divine feminine knows who they are. This person is standing in their power. Somebody is experiencing a spiritual awakening here. That's what I'm getting. Somebody took you for granted. That's what I'm getting here. There's a divine feminine here that was straight up betrayed. I'm hearing by a fake friend or a sibling here. Or somebody did something out of resentment because they wanted to hurt you here. You were the black sheep of the family. That's what I'm getting here. Yep. Look, baby steps. Follow your intuition before it makes sense. You already knew this. So this divine feminine already knew. This divine feminine is very intuitive. This divine feminine is going along this spiritual journey on her own. Standing in her power. Unafraid. Period. Somebody straight up tried to play a divine feminine. Because she was different. Or not the stereotypical idea of what a divine feminine would look like here. Somebody 
Somebody is in regret. What's going on here? Yep, look. All paths lead to home. Inner authority. Turn your gaze within. I'm getting like this divine feminine went within to get the answers that she needed. This divine feminine knew all along what was really going on here. That's what I'm getting here. This person took their power back and moved on. Somebody moved on. Yep, look. Somebody is now setting boundaries. Look, we have blue flame here. Somebody is now setting boundaries here. That's what I'm getting here. And like this divine feminine, let whoever it is, I'm hearing a karmic friend or a sibling, or it could have been a friend and a sibling involved in the situation, but I'm getting like this divine feminine, let these individuals be. This person is taking their power back moving forward. This person has new love coming in for them. New opportunities here. That's what I'm getting here. Yep, you're not alone. Somebody isolated a divine feminine. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody did not think that a divine feminine was a divine feminine because of how she looked. Somebody was very closed-minded here. That's what I'm getting here. This feminine energy is getting a new beginning here. This divine feminine is an earth angel. That's what I'm getting here. What's going on here? What advice do you have for the collective? Wow, that's too many here. What advice do you have for the collective in regards to this? Yep, eat to live. What advice do you have here for the collective? We have sit with your emotions. I'm also getting this uh, feminine energy could have been, somebody could have been very stressed out here in the past. Something in regards to alcohol or somebody could have been using food to cope here as well. Yeah, but now somebody is focusing on their diet here. Yeah, we have May. May could be significant. Somebody's birthday could be in May. Definitely with that fixed signs out here. Somebody could be a Taurus here. That's what I'm getting here. You could have Taurus placements in your chart here as well. What's going on here? Or what advice do you have here? Yeah, we have November here. What advice do you have here? Yep, and we have December. So I'm getting like Taurus, Sagittarius here. I'm also getting Capricorn here as well. I'm also getting somebody could be a Scorpio here as well. Yeah, you are protected, period. I'm getting like you are moving forward here. Focusing on your diet here as well. Somebody wanted you to prove yourself here. I'm getting like you don't have to do all that. Definitely with this be a good person, but don't waste your time proving it in unrequited love. Yep, somebody was accusing you of being a bad person here as well. I'm getting this because of this karmic sibling that this person was dealing with. That's what I'm getting here. Or something in regards to your friend here. This person was in a relationship with your friend or somebody that you knew. Or somebody, yeah, something like that. What's going on here? Yep. Yeah. We have stopped worrying about what other people think of you. So I'm getting like you got out of your head and you have moved on. And you are healing and you are no longer concerned with what other people think of you here. That's what I'm getting here. You're moving forward. Yeah, we have August and we have January here. Somebody did not see your true potential or somebody felt like you were not a divine feminine. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody felt like you were a bad person or somebody was trying to make you out to be a bad person here. That's what I'm getting here. I'm also getting that there's a karmic masculine that had a divine feminine trying to prove themselves. Like somebody wanted a divine feminine to prove themselves in a relationship. This person moved on. That's what I'm getting here. Somebody was also married as well. That's what I'm getting here. Like, yeah, somebody took their power back and somebody is healing and moving forward here. But I'm going to end it there. All right, bye, collective.